I can smell it a mile away. Are they seriously gonna be able to pull this off? Gotta trust them. She was saying stuff like, I'll just seduce him with my acting, but that sounds out of her league. Plus, we ain't got one sign this place is gonna open. Isn't Matarame coming home soon? On top of that, even if Mona's able to unlock the door, how's he gonna show it to Matarame? I just realized, is Matarame gonna show up in the palace at the same time that real Matarame comes home? No, well, maybe? I don't know. I, I can't really tell if that was the deal with Kamoshida. And then even if they do show it open, any normal person would just close it right up again. Doesn't that mean we only got a few seconds to get in? To be blunt, won't it be a miracle if this works? Let's wait and see. We've done our part. Yeah. It's almost time. Oh boy, my heart's pounding. Please, can you just wait and... What's past here? That's... So the door Mona mentioned is up ahead. I keep telling you, you can't. You're still not done? It's hard to do this with cat paws. Uh, is something the matter? Oh, um... So... What is this room? It's a storage area for old paintings. Storage? Hey, Kitagawa-kun. Why don't we... do it in here? I won't be embarrassed if we go somewhere nobody can find us. Only Sensei can go in there. Please! I want to be alone with you. Oh, he rapping her... her uh, oh my god. Oh, I fumbled those words. Somewhere like quiet. <laughs> you know, where we won't get interrupted. Is he really going to buy that terrible idea? He's been buying it so far. Stay focused. Hmm? Oh, it's just so frustrating that my feelings aren't getting through to you. Kitagawa-kun, do you not like girls like me? No, th that's not true. <laughs> How is that working on him? Please... We can continue this... inside. Sh sure. I mean, no, we can't go in there. <laughs> uh, it's locked anyway, so... Fine. This is too embarrassing. I'm leaving. Uh-oh, she playing her... She... <laughs> but... Let's just do it in here, okay? He's like, in here, I'm leaving. What do I do? I'm home. Oh shit. S sensei. Uh oh. Yusuke. All right, it's open. Uh oh. Holy shit. Huh? Drama. What are you doing there? Drama. It's it's not what it looks like. <laughs> you know, I pictured him saying it's not what it looks like, but I pictured him doing something else at that point. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Not in there. I feel like Palace security is about to go up. Uh, nothing's happening. I wonder what's hmm? It's off. Oh, there you go. They seriously did it. All right. Yeah, still stay on guard though. I'm sure there are enemies in there. Oh, right. These could come back on at any second. Let's go. Good work, Anne. Good work. I can't believe he fell for almost all of that. Alright, anything to collect around here? What if the door closed, like, right in my face? I would cry. Where do these stairs lead to? Oh, nowhere. Okay. 
Fine. Treasure Hall Lounge. All right. Wait, Treasure Hall? Alright, let's find the control room. The path's gonna close if we dig around too long. But it's just gonna be me and you for a bit if we run into any enemies. Okay. Oh, like this thing? How am I supposed to hide from it? I can feel it. And it looks like his level's pretty high too. He's glowing red. <laughs> Damn it already? Hey, what do you want to do? Okay, this looks like the museum's equivalent of those golden soldiers. We have to beat it. Hey! The real problem is the fact that we just gotta handle this with just the two of us. Anyways, I'll leave the timing up to you, dude. Alright, maybe I should have taught that new persona I had a uh, fire after all, because Anne's not even with us. Sorry. Yo, you're gonna let us through right now. Hmm? Who are you? I see that attire. You must be the thieves who dare threaten Lord Matarame. Oh, wow. What is this thing? They got past the security system? You cannot go any further. You are trespassing on Lord Matarame's territory. You guys ain't got nothing on us. I'm more scared of screwing up and having on yell at me. <laughs> no weakness. Persona. All right, let's experiment. Skullcracker. Ooh. Well, we can headbutt him first. Get our damage started. Or I might just have Ryuji just, you know, do what he wants. Uses um, HP attacks because those seem to be doing. Okay, he resists curse. Does he just resist all the elements? Medicine. Okay. Oh, this thing knows Augie anyway, I forgot. Okay. Yep, he's weak to fire! Alright. Ooh! Surprised I didn't kill Ryuji. Leveled up. All right, level up. All right, feel even stronger. Whew! <sighs> Things are real tough when it's just me and you. It'd be a pain in the ass if we got spotted again. Anyway, let's turn off that security system. Son, this is bad. Meanwhile, in the real world, are these the lights? Huh? Oh, what the? Wait a minute. Those are the painting. I mean, I knew the guy was plagiarizing, but those are the paintings that inspired Yusuke to be an artist, right? Isn't this Sayuri? Yeah. Why are there so many of them? Yeah, he's like a a bunch of copies of them. I have no idea. Even Yusuke doesn't know. Get out. Uh oh. Sensei, what is the meaning of this? I suppose I can't keep quiet now that you've seen this. Truth be told, I'm in severe debt. I handmade these Sayuri copies and have been selling them through a special connection of mine. But why? The real Sayuri was stolen. One of my pupils long ago. I assume they begrudged my strictness. That moment was quite a shock for me. Since then, I've been mired in a terrible artist block. Because of this distress, some of my pupils handed their ideas over to me from time to time. Or did you take it from them by force? Uh. 
I knew I couldn't keep that up, so I attempted to recreate the Sayuri a number of times. However, it resulted in nothing more than replicas. That's when someone came to buy the paintings, knowing, well, they weren't original. It's all my fault. I couldn't pay the price of being famous. As expectations for me rose, it reached a point where I had no choice but to keep making them. I needed money to further your talents. I ask that you please forgive your cowardly teacher. There's more to that story than he's letting on. Please, don't. Hold on, something doesn't add up. Uh-oh. If the original painting got stolen, how did you make copies of it? I happened to find a finely detailed photograph of it in an art book. So you managed to sell copies of a photo of the original? I'm not sure how this works, but don't people who buy paintings generally have a keen eye for the fine arts? True. This sounds like a lie to me. Uh-oh. What would you know? Something just doesn't feel right. Lady On! This one seems different. Sayuri? Is that the original one? This... This is the real Sayuri. So he has the original. But you just said a moment ago that it was stolen. Lies! Lies! That's a replica. <laughs> and his entire demeanor's changed no, too. It's nothing of the sort. This painting kept me going. It's the reason I made it this far. Sensei, don't tell me. It's fake. Yes, a counterfeit. I heard there was a counterfeit spreading around, so I bought it. So you're telling me the actual artist behind the painting bought a counterfeit? That's pushing it. The actual... Ugh. You're lying, Sensei. Hold on a second, this whole thing about counterfeit paintings has got me a bit confused. Because I don't really remember, who did he... Who painted Sayuri again? This would all add up if I could just remember who painted it, but it's been like a month since I played the game, so I don't remember. Please, just tell us the truth. You too. What the? Is he calling the police? I've reported you to my private security company. Who? And you scare both of them. What? Uh oh. I had it set up to deal with some problematic paparazzi, but I never thought it'd come in so handy. Please wait. Let's talk about this. Talk all you want to the police. That includes you. you scare. Oh shoot! He's even getting rid of his own pupil. <laughs> Where did it? There's no point. They'll be here within two minutes. Uh oh. Takamaki san! He called the police. He straight up called the police on us. Basically. Yeah, let's go! Well, let's hurry up and get that shit stuff off. Or so something like I don't know. I wasn't really reading it. Wait, where do we go now? Is this it? Yeah, this looks like it. All right. Oh, yeah, this is the room. So, which one's for the security? Oh, oh, for the security. I guess the one that's on. Disengaging security protocol. Sweet, now the lasers in the courtyard should be off for good. Well, that mission's complete. Come on, let's get out of here. Alright, something tells me we're gonna run into like a boss or something on our way out. Hey, who's there? Whoa. Crap, let's make a run for it! Alright, All right, looks like security's totally off. Let's get back and meet up with the others. Those two managed to get away. No! What the? <laughs> I 
thought I was gonna die. <laughs> hey, will you let go already? Oh. Oh no! I didn't mean to push him so hard. Are you okay? Wake up! Who are you all? Oh, you know us. Uh, calm down, Kitagawa-kun. It's me. Kamaki-san. That means you two are. I don't recall ever seeing this cat costume before, though. <laughs> what is this place? We are inside Madarame's heart. Inside Sensei's heart? I'm sorry, Takamaki-san, but are you sure you're feeling okay? She ain't lying. This is what that bastard truly feels. He's nothing but a greed-filled money grubber. Enough of this rubbish! Oh, come on. He was going to turn you into the police. Kitagawa-kun, didn't it cross your mind that something wasn't right about Madarame? <sighs> That's... Uh... You may not want to believe it, but this is another reality as viewed through Madarame's eyes. This is his true nature. This repulsive world? Just who are all of you? I guess you could say we're a group that changes the hearts of Ron Crooks. If everything you say is true, then the sensei I know doesn't exist. You gotta snap out of it. So wait, did Yusuke not know about what Madarame was doing before? It seems like he legitimately didn't know. That's the impression I'm getting. Still, he has kept me safe these past ten years. My gratitude for that won't just disappear. You're gonna forgive him? At this rate, you'll... What Are you okay? What's up with him? I'm trying to be rational about this, but my emotions are overwhelming me. Oh, understandable. Sorry, but we don't have time to dawdle. The security level's gone through the roof. We need to get out of here at once. Oh, I forgot about that security level. I feel like he's gonna catch us like right at the front door. He's gonna be like, hey, 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 where do you guys think you're going? Let's go. Yes. Yes! Alright, we need to hurry out of here. That said, we have an amateur with us now. Let's try and avoid fighting as much as possible. Alright, uh, ooh. Well, can't we just quick travel? Oh, we can't. Oh, wait, yeah, because Yusuke doesn't have any powers, so, yeah. Alright, fine. How could this be? So this is... Inside of Sensei's heart. A vain museum such as this? Ah, oh, it's that music again. Ah, uh, this painting! Do you recognize it? We were thinking this might be past pupils or something. But why are there paintings of them here? Technically, those aren't actual paintings, they're the pupils themselves. <laughs> Madarame saw them as objects, so that's why... that's what they are in here. Oh, and uh, we found yours too. What? Oh, he didn't say anything, but I'm sure that's what he was thinking. We'll talk more later. For now, let's get out of here. There are enemies in that next room, it looks like. Oh no! It is right there! <laughs> oh, Madarame looking fancy Who though. <laughs> what the? Dressed in all gold! <laughs> <laughs> Talk about bullshit clothes! First a king, now some kind of shogun! Yeah. Welcome to the museum of the master artist, Madarame! Ooh, you pale too. Huh? Sensei? Is that you? That attire? Disgusting! This... this is all one big lie, isn't it? My usual ragged attire is nothing but an act. Besides a famous person living in that shack, I have another home. 
Under a mistress's name, of course. Oh boy. <laughs> That's absurd. <laughs> How naive. If the Sayuri was stolen, why was it in the storage room? And if you had the real one, why make copies? Yeah, why would you make copies of the other real one? If it's really you, Sensei, please tell me. Foolish child, you still don't see? Painting being stolen was just a false rumor I spread. It was all a perfectly calculated staging. Oh boy. What do you mean? Let me see. How does this sound? I found the real painting, but it can't go public. You can have it for a special price, though. Oh, all to make more money. What a surprise. <laughs> How's that for preferential treatment? Art sobs will eat it up and pay good cash at that. No. The worth of art is purely subjective. Thus, this is a legitimate business transaction. Though I doubt a brat like you would ever come up with such a brilliant scheme. Yo, Shadow Matarame almost seems like a different character from like his real life counterpart. <laughs> you keep going on and on about money this, money that. At least Shadow Kamashita mostly looked like real Kamashita. No wonder you ended up with this disgusting museum. You're supposed to be an artist, right? Aren't you ashamed of plagiarizing other people's work? Nah, and money talks. Money talks. Art is nothing but a tool. A tool to gain money and fame. You helped me greatly as well, Yusuke. God, it pisses me off. That's your teacher. But what about the people who believe in you? Who think you're a master artist? I'll tell you this alone, Yusuke. But we're right here, so you're technically telling us, too. If you wish to succeed in this world, I'd advise you don't rise against me. Do you believe anyone could find success with my objection holding them down? <laughs> to think I was under the care of this wretched man. Oh my goodness. You thought I took you in out of the goodness in my heart? I was wondering if all these other villains were going to be as bad as Kamoshida, and it looks like that's going to be the case. Plucking talented yet troubled artists allows me to find promising pupils and take their ideas. After all, it's much easier to steal the futures of children who can't fight back. You're... you're awful. No, uh-uh. I can't believe this. I mean, people do that, but the fact that you just kind of proudly said that is pretty sickening. Livestock are killed for their hide and meat. This is no different, you fool. Uh, but I'm tired of this little chat. It's time that I... You are unforgivable. It's time that you get your ass kicked by Yusuke, because I think he's about to awaken a persona. It doesn't matter who you are. I won't forgive you. So... You repay my keeping you around for all these years with ingratitude? You damn brat! I mean, you just told him you're a piece of shit. What did you, ex what did you expect his reaction to be? Men, dispose of these thieves! Get back! You're a bigger thief than we are. How amusing. Huh? <laughs> it seems the truth is stranger than fiction, huh? Kitagawa-kun? I wanted to believe it wasn't true. I had clouded my vision for so long. My eyes were truly blind. Blind and unable to see the true self behind this one horrible man. Oh, it's that time again. Have you finally come to your senses? How foolishly you averted your eyes from the truth. A deplorable imitation indeed. Best you part from that aspect of yourself.
Let us now forge a contract. <laughs> I am thou, thou art I. Oh, he drawing blood. Both beauty and vice. It is time you teach people which is which. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Modern Army's like, oh, what have I done? Come. I've made a mistake. Go am on! Go am on. Is that a Digimon? <laughs> Your persona is a Digimon? <laughs> a breathtaking sight. Imitations they may be, but together they make a fine spectacle. Though the flowers of evil blossom, be it known, abominations are fated to perish! Whoa, this is impressive! He is pretty stylish. <laughs> Who do you think you are? The price for your insolence will be death! Where are my guards? Kill them all! The children who adored you as father. The prospects of your pupils. How many did you trample upon? And he's smiling about it too. Exchange for riches. No matter what it takes, I will bring you to justice! Hey, you got the, you better not run away. Same goes to you. Don't run with the tail between your legs. You are in the presence of Lord Marwame. And on your knees, intruders. I learned much from I wonder Marame. in order to see authenticity, one must be dispassionately realistic. I said tail between his legs, his outfit does actually come with a tail. Um, I wonder, can we fit five people in the party, or are we going to have to, like, move somebody to make room for him? With Goemon by my side, I can now ascertain your true self without any reservations. Goemon Digivolve 2. I'm sorry, I'm thinking of Digimon now, the last part of that thing's name. Okay. Okay, they kicked Morgana out. Anyway. I am thou. Okay, he knows ice type moves. Goemon, strike! What? Ooh. Well, Yuji still has um, low HP as well. He didn't recover from that last fight. Okay, this guy is obviously the boss. So let's take out the henchman. What? He missed? Oh boy. Okay, I think that guy in the middle resists fire. Who heals? Who heals? Who heals? Nobody. Decrease your defense. All right, we need to heal Ryuji, like now. Using. And he gets knocked right back down again. What a waste! Oh, we're really struggling. Oh. Can we make this guy dizzy? Let's try it. Nope, of course not. We gotta use it. Alright, he's dead.
Anything else? We got revival stuff, but if Joker dies, we're done anyway. This will do. Joker. Stop hitting me! Damn. Ah. Uh, Jesus Christ. I can barely keep myself alive. I am Giant slice, medium physical damage. Why can't I use it? Fine. We still haven't beaten the boss yet either. Alright, if this doesn't hit, we're in trouble. Alright, but it did. Yes, I can see that. I really kind of wish Morgana was here. Is he weak to fire? Well, we gotta find his weakness so fast. Wonder if it's holy. Go down! Let's try it. Nope. Persona. Let's increase his accuracy and evasion. Defense reverted. Let's try lightning. Nope. Can we put him to sleep? No. What have we not tried? Well, we haven't tried Curse. No, he resists that too. Why can't he use Giant Slice? Oh, because I don't have any HP. Duh, that's why. Is he, like, programmed to use Sledgehammer every time I heal somebody? Because that's what it seems like. Where are those revival items? Revival bead. Get up, Yusuke. Get up. I apologize. Let's try this. Yep. Giant slice. Got him. Odd attack. God, you were a pain. You were a pain. I think it was just because there was a lot of you. Like, there was like four guys plus the boss. Might need to level up to make sure that doesn't happen again. Oh, he wore himself out. You say you've just thrown your bright future down the drain. I'll destroy every chance you've ever had of becoming an artist. Uh-oh, I guess this is going to affect IRL, um, Madarame as well. Madarame! You'll forever rue the day you dared defy me! Get back here! Kitago-kun! Why can't I move? Listen, you're totally drained. You can't do much even if you wanted to. What a disgrace I am. No, we all went through the same thing. You're good. Come on, just listen to her. You've known for quite some time, haven't you? Oh, he did know. I'm no fool. Strange people have been coming by for years. And the plagiarism was an everyday affair. But who would want to admit that the man they owed their life to was doing such terrible things? Why didn't you leave, Kitagawa-kun? Well, he is the one who painted the Sayori. On top of that, I owe him a great debt. Okay, that's right. I couldn't remember if he was the one who painted it, or if Yusuke painted it, or if someone else painted it. It's been that long since I played this game. You mean because he raised you? I never knew my father. Oh. I was told my mother raised me by herself, but 
she died in an accident when I was three. Why does something tell me he had something to do with that accident? Considering everything that's happened in the game, I wouldn't be surprised at this point. That's when Sensei took me in. Heard? To be honest, I don't remember much about my mother either. I did everything I could for Sensei. I thought of him as a father. But he changed. I think he would treat the Sayori, the very foundation of his art, like that. Mm. A lot's happened to you, huh? When you had mentioned plagiarism, deep down, I knew you were right. That's why I so vehemently denied you. I was simply running from the truth. So you, you're not gonna sue us anymore, right? Well, Madarame's already on our asses, so I guess that doesn't matter anymore. No worries. Thank you. It's all good. You're in trouble with the rest of us anyway now. I'm grateful for the chance to face what I've been denying all this time. You're way too serious, man. That's why you're always getting stuck in your own head. Look at me. I just go with the flow. For real. <laughs> what are you going to do now? I don't know. We can't help the fact that Madarame's gone and changed. But, we can change his heart. We'll make him pay for his crimes. That reminds me. You mentioned something about that change of heart earlier. Have you heard the rumors? The ones about the phantom thieves that steal hearts? <gasps> Don't tell me. It took you that long to figure it out? Oh, oh. We better leave. We'll talk later. We need to scram. That's enough phantom thievery for one day. When did my clothes change? Do these people seriously not look down when they like awaken and then fight like the bad guys and stuff and oh my god. You just noticed that now? Exactly. Save it for after. Let's go. I see. And because of that, this PE teacher's had a change of heart. Yep. Phantom thieves who steal hearts. To think they truly exist. Right in front of you. Indeed. Well, I have to believe your words. Especially after seeing a world like that. The <laughs> Morgana's in the bag. So, your plan with Madarame-sensei. With Madarame is to force a change of heart, correct? Let me join, as a member of the Phantom Thieves. I mean, Had he has a persona. Sooner, this may have been avoided. He has a persona, you might as well let him in. I must put an end to this, for the sake of the others whose futures as artists were robbed as well. That is the most civil thing I can do for the man who was, in some manner, my father. Civil, huh? Sounds fine to me. We're gonna deal with Madarame anyways. He may have a mental shutdown if we screw up. We have ways to prevent that, but they aren't fail-safe. Remember how we mentioned this on our way here? Madarame is a man who has the art world under his thumb. He has connections to many organizations. If someone like me raises my voice, it'll only be snubbed out. We have no option but this. Chitago akun It's a deal, then. We have a new member in the Phantom Thieves now. I hope we get along, Yusuke. You better not slow us down. I'll do my best. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we gotta address this. No more nude paintings. Uh, so that was all a plan. Well, that's quite daring, Takamaki-san. Yeah, don't get your hopes up. It wasn't my idea. It was theirs. What else were we supposed to do? It's his fault for going on and on about the nude modeling thing. 
I haven't given up on that yet, though. Give it up! <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I wonder what's going on with the real Matarame. Yusuke and I were in a pretty tight situation. Actually, I contacted him before we came here. He believes that I continued pursuing Takamaki-san. And, just as you all explained, it appears he knows nothing about his shadow. What did he say? He was complaining to the security company how they couldn't even catch one high school girl. However, he's still furious about it, and said that he's going to take legal action against everyone. Oh boy. Talk about being completely on guard. So we're still in trouble. Legal action? He's acting way too desperate. Maybe he still has more secrets. If he were to act, it'd be after the exhibit is over. Any scandal during the show would be his loss. I see. Right when I think the talk about being a nude model is over, this happens? We'll have to force a change of heart before then if we're to dodge this legal action thing. Looks like our plan must be accomplished while the exhibit is still open. Yep. By the way, what is this? What's what? Huh? A cat. But it's talking. You have a problem with that? <laughs> no, not really. Why not? I mean, it's probably the least weird thing he's seen today. He's just on a different wavelength than other people. Do you wish to draw me? You better bring out the best of me in that case. Hmm. Hey, don't touch me like... I was thinking of ordering some black bean jelly. I bet he got that idea from a black cat. Oh! I didn't bring any money. Oh, so you're gonna make us pay for that? Never mind. He's just weird. I hope you aren't up to no good. Don't forget that you're still in a probation. Got that one messed up and you're finished. No, no good. No, no, no. What's wrong about changing the hearts of criminals? We're doing the right thing. Legal action. This ain't funny. Yeah, that sounds problematic. If the police hear about this, they'll totally get in touch with the school. We'll get expelled for sure this time. <laughs> I feel like that's going to be a recurring theme in this game. School would be the least of our worries. We'd end up arrested. Unlawful entry, defamation. Guess that means we really can't afford to F it up this time. Yeah, from here on out is what really matters. Let's do it. Hey. We just need to change his heart before he presses charges. Try to focus on that problem for now. Alright, I'm pretty sure we can't do anything because we went to the palace, so... Yeah. Actually, hold on, let me stay up for a second. Because what I'm gonna do... I'm tired too, I'm gonna end the episode here, so... Next time, I guess now with Yusuke in tow, we'll, um... Explore more of Madarame's palace a little later and... Try and change his heart before... You know... Yeah, before he takes legal action, so... I'll see you guys then. I'll just add this.